We were going to tear it all down. The Institute, Providence, everyone who'd ever hurt us. We failed. The partners grew paranoid, made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. Ortmeier was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to that. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> but he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first constant. If we find him, if he's still alive, he's our way in. You don't know who he is, but 47 does. That's what this reunion is all about. Show them. You're just gonna hand it over. Our one bargaining chip. Olivia. Fine. What the hell? Again. Tear it all down. The Institute. Providence. Everyone who'd ever hurt us. We failed. The partners grew paranoid, made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. What Maya was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to that. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> But he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first constant. If we find him, if he's still alive, he's our way in. You don't know who he is. But 47 does. <laughs> That's what this reunion is all about. Show them. You're just going to hand it over. Our one bargaining chip. Olivia. Fine. 47's memory was erased, irreversibly at the time. But after Ortmeier's death, his estate was acquired by the Ether Corporation. And they made an antidote. It's a long shot, I know. This is not how it works. We don't just join the revolution. ICA is neutral. We don't take sides. I hate to break it to you, lady, but neutrality is a side. It's the side of the status quo. People have died. Civilians. You align yourself with terrorists, murderers. Sometimes even monsters serve a purpose. Look. Enough. You have a choice. But I made mine a long time ago. I will finish what I started. Subject 47, most gifted of all my boys. So you're the pick of the litter. Tell me about the incident. The subject ran away, he and another boy. The instigator was punished accordingly. As were all the neighbors. My men did what needed to be done. It won't happen again. Bring your house in order, Doctor. You won't like the alternative. Why does he sound like Palpatine? I remember.
already seen this. Gentlemen, let's go over the plan. The first constant is none other than Janus, the legendary Cold War spy master, a KGB senior officer and head of the sixth column special branch at Lubienka. Janus is a certified genius and expert of counterintelligence. He retired from the KGB in 1988 when he fell out of favor with the Kremlin and defected to the US. Shortly after, the Soviet Union collapsed. Now, it is unclear when Janus stepped down as the constant, but since 2004, he has been a resident of a quiet community in suburban Vermont. Mr. Gray. Right. So here's the catch. As an elite KGB agent, Janus was trained to withstand interrogation and torture. No amount of pressure will force him to disclose information he doesn't want to. Instead, we will need to search his home for clues. But if Providence learns of our presence, the game is up. So we frame Janus, make Providence think he was the real Shadow Client. Correct. I will file a false ICA report, claiming to have traced a number of calls from Janus' house to the Institute in Romania. The case was seem clear. Mr. Gray was only a figurehead. Janus was pulling the strings all along. And by eliminating him, we will have neutralized the militia once and for all. However, for this subterfuge to work, you will also need to deal with Janus's security detail. A Providence Herald and former Secret Service agent by the name of Nolan Cassidy. Intel describes him as diligent and inquisitive, and we cannot risk that he contradicts our story to his employer. Seems workable. I certainly hope so. Everything depends on this next move, 47. You made this our fight. Now let's even the playing field. Cuckoo caca. We're gonna get the big, big bomb. Gonna get the cuckoo one. These two peepee -pee heads. Let's do these. Went to the crocodile farm today. Show the crocodile. Big guy. Crocodile. Your bones. You want me to cut your bones? When does Boba Fett come out? Wednesday? What's today? Tuesday.
Whittleton Creek, Vermont. On the surface, a picture-perfect suburban dream. Wide roads, golden maple trees, and verdant lawns. Most residents here are white-collar professionals, ranging from university staff to government employees. Most, but not all. Janus's unpresuming home is protected by a host of bodyguards, and intel shows that the fragile former constant rarely leaves the property. Nolan Cassidy, on the other hand, roams the neighborhood streets. A recent arrival, the Duke Herald is busy making threat assessments and settling in with his security team. Now remember, this is about more than just revenge. Janus is the key to bring down Providence. So get in there and find us a lead. Good luck, 47. An apple a day keeps the FBI away. Forty-seven. I've marked your map with several points of interest. We're running this mission with very little upfront intel, but these locations could provide clues to help you obtain the information you need. Good luck. Slow and steady wins the race, right? No st ah! Cool sergeant. It's <laughs> a nice looking Glock. Is that a Glock in your pocket? No, it's two. Shipping container to store some chemicals. I asked him if it was poisonous, but he assured me that it was only a sleeping agent. Get this. He told me that he doesn't kill the bugs, he only sedates them. A pet a fumigator. So that he can set them free later. Let me get this straight. He's an exterminator who cares about the lives of insects. Uh, excuse me? This is a private area. Come on, Whoa. dude. Time to go to work. Hey, you. What do you see the problem here? Some skeevy-looking dude is totally trespassing over there. Thanks, Thanks for your help. help. I'll report your information. Command, I think the purpose left the scene. Yeah, well, I know who to look for. Until then, I'm standing down. Take a look big. Hey, this area is up. Oh, 
one day, he heard his mother It just has to save right there. Apparently, them so that he can set them free later. house before he can remove the hookup to my house that is nolan cassidy former secret service agent and current providence herald cassidy is assigned to protect janus janus with an anus <laughs>
Okay, it's up there. Cassidy looks to be a gun enthusiast. The room looks like it's outfitted with a lot of security and alarms. Nicely done, 47. This should keep things nice and quiet inside the house. some sort. The note mentions another house. Perhaps Cassidy is using one of the vacant buildings as base of operations, 47. Hmm. A letter from Janus to someone called Zoe. It looks like a draft and is full of explicit descriptions of how unhappy Janus is with Zoe and his sister having been appointed chairwomen of the Ark Society. Hmm. I've heard that name before. This is a good find, 47. down. Good work, Marissa. Janus awaits your attention.
I want nothing but breadcrumbs to be found. That's the only guy that's actually knocked out. <laughs> yeah, that is. Back in the day. Janus was known for his obsessive need to archive and keep memorabilia. If he has any microfilm in his house, it might contain something interesting.
Jameis. Cold War spymaster and the first Providence Constant. I wonder how much he remembers. How little he cares. One of Janus's old microfilms. It might contain important information. All you need now is to find a device to read it on. I'm gonna take you down! I don't think you're supposed to be here, mister. This is a private area. I'm getting help! Just wait!
That is cool. Very cool. Which I had a basement. <laughs> no, this is not a basement. This is an attic. Clearly, Janus is a meticulous man. This microfilm contains a lot of heavily redacted minutes from what appears to be a yearly event of some sort. Plenty of initials and project code names that don't ring any bells. Janus is mentioned by name throughout, however. This is a very important find, 47. G'day, mate. Goodbye, mate. I find clues. No, this batty guy is driving me crazy. Every time he sees me, he comes out and wants to talk. And the problem is he just won't shut up. Always ranting about that damn lawsuit against Janus and waving piles of paper at me. As if I give a rat's ass about their problems. Let the judge sort it out. What do I want? A lawsuit want between Janus and a local resident. It might be up. just what we're looking for. Want added pay for this batty I lives want batty in number 432. Locate the lawsuit. You're gonna shoot yourself in the foot. The mappy, yeah, the crappy. don't like you. You're a bad, bad possum. Bad people die. Ooh, what's that? Janus is apparently engaged in a civil lawsuit with another resident of Whittleton Creek. James Batty, the plaintiff, wants Janus to stop his annual landing of a helicopter. Near the local creek, Batty claims it interrupts the nesting birds and a species of frog that has been declared endangered. Must be a very important trip given his poor health. Time to get you Janus. We now know Janus is meeting with a constant at an event related to the Ark Society. And we have an approximate date as well. I think that's all we're going to get. We're close to the finish line. It's time to end this. Where's the one that smoking is bad for you? Yeah, no smokies. Smoky bad. Smoky not good for you. Smoky kill. But me very funny. Hey. So, Janus smokes. That was funny! Funny poo poo! <laughs> it's 
Thank you. I can't wait to kill this man. That sends a violent, doesn't it? Good work, 47. All there is left to do now is wait. Now we wait. While we're at it, actually I'm gonna save just in case I stuff up. Which is gonna happen. <laughs> Anybody home? Hello? Nobody home. Damn. Wait, is this the party? No. Yes. Yes. Smoke. Smoke, you idiot. Dun, bang, bang. At last, the actions of the first constant catch up. Jeez, that actually scared me. <laughs> My God. now, gentlemen. Both targets are dead. All mission objectives are completed. 47, once you've left Whittleton Creek, I will notify Providence of our discovery. In the meantime, we'll go over the clues you found. Once we've located the constant, we'll make our final move. You make it sound so easy. Dunny dun dun That, 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 that. 
Apple Day keeps the FBI away. Ugh, Germany. The Ark really? Society. One of Providence's more obscure outfits. I've heard whispers. A survivalist club for the global elite. Billionaires preparing for a global collapse. And now we know the Constant will attend their next gathering. So where is it? That's the catch. The report is redacted. No names, no location. So it's a dead end. I can't track them, not without ICA backup. Now, I'm no big shot analyst, but it seems to me Janus was the Ark Society's founder. So chances are they'll want to pay their respects in private. Track the coffin. Worth a shot. You're right. It comes back in flashes. Fear, anger, but like it happened to someone else. <laughs> your gift and your curse, what they did to you. Well, I spent a long time feeling guilty about that. Now, I wonder who got the better deal. Yes, found something. What are we looking at? The ass end of nowhere. But this is where Janus's remains were shipped to. Our choice for a final resting place, wouldn't you say? Not bad. So we stake it out. Await the next gathering. Then we waltz in and kidnap one of the world's most powerful men. Without ICA backup. Like I said, it's a long shot. We'll take it.